Alright, so, the marathon continues. I'm gonna be playing some um, Elder Titan yet again because I actually want to change something. I can't change. Why have? <laughs> why am I running with again two of them? That's from previous game, but still it's strange that it's still there. Okay, let's get some XP's. Oh, he's got even images. It's very unlucky, man. Very unlucky. Could it be at least like regen rune sometimes? Sometimes we are very unlucky with these runes against us. Okay, we are so far juking effectively. <laughs> Alrighty. Does he have boots? He doesn't have boots. The beginning of a soul ring. You can't really kill them. You need to wait out the illusions. As I'm doing, professionally. Okay, there we go. Let's see what's the. Oh, that's a real one, by the way. Yeah, my damage is more than yours, bro. <laughs> Don't try this shit on me. Right now, uh, Quo basically fucked us over because he could destroy Skyrath Mage. You know why? Orb. Skyrath Mage would be absolutely demolished because of the orb, but that guy definitely didn't want to play this game. Uh, very selfish guy. That's what's going to be happening in the matchmaking a lot of times. Selfish people. Uh, because that's, a, that's the number one problem of... Of, um... Really? Why he's still there? No, I mean, he could run towards me and be pretty much safe, but he chose to be actually on top. Yeah, Quo basically fucked us over by being, being selfish. We already had mid hero, he picked second mid hero. I could solo, I had solo here. We had all the heroes prepared, but he was selfish, very selfish. Normally, that would, I, would re I would report it immediately. You know why? Because if he does, does it in one game, he's doing it in more than one game. So usually I had the biggest success just reporting these type of guys. Because they are doing it in every single game of theirs. Okay. I'm level 3. Right now Klinks is going to be definitely trouble because I have, you know, 800 HPs. He doesn't. <laughs> He's limited of HPs right now, unfortunately. That's why this hero is actually viable very much for the hard lane very much for Harlan because he has such a high stat base that not many people can kind of go through that. Okay, unfortunately I can't really stun him because he's gonna... Fury! You're farming bro, I don't know. If you wanna farm me or what? We have okay lane, of course with the Chen coming here it's not gonna be so effective. I still can pretty much deflect their initiation easily. Um, Disruptor could cancel it, obviously, with his stuff. Um, with the glimpse, he could probably cancel my shit before I actually cast a stun. Oh, there's a chain. Yeah. There's still a sentry. He's pulling too much, though, as you can see from the. He's pulling too much. What the fuck? What the delay, bros? What a delay. What a bullshit. I always cancel it like that. Oh my god. That had to be pink at least 100. At least 100. By the way, I played four people that are like, what did what delay? And it wasn't. Um, I played 15 games in a row with this hero. Um, I basically played the whole day, <laughs> all Friday, to bring you one good game, so I know exactly everything about this hero, okay? And that was definitely cancellation. I always cancel it like 0 0.2, 0 0.1 second before it actually, uh, you know, casts, because that's the delay that it kind of provides to you. Trying to be most effective, but definitely that was a fairly high pink, I would say. This is this is the as you can see this is the problem of the big pull that they did that is gonna be pushing towards us right now. Okay, 
kind of want to farm like somehow, but. Let's see what he has. Okay. He definitely should be doing just that. Yeah. It's sad because I really would like to play solo on this lane. Just level. Just get levels, arcane boots, and then this hero is ready. You're finished basically with your arcane boots if you are going for the hard lane, which I couldn't, which I'm very sad about. Because we're not gonna get advantage with Klinks here and me here. The advantage is nothing, actually. Really? Okay, he's actually getting fucking away. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Okay, let's get our So Scarver didn't die yet, which is definitely co-op. Klinks will be actually kind of, you know, from level 1, that's the point. From level 1 he can do so much. He could be standing here and attacking Scarver Mage, and you know, he has one nuke. It's a big difference. Kind of, kind of a tr let's, I would actually want to see how much damage Klinks can do against Scarver Mage. Middle kind of want to see missing. that, but obviously not in this one. Oh, that's actually like three times my Middle attack speed. Is missing. What is this Shen doing? Jesus. Okay, there's a pull. Um, the problem is that he's out attack. Everything about him is out attack, so we can't really do much aggression here. Can't really do much with that. We officially Spectre. Hmm. This Chen is fairly bad. Yeah, sure. Yeah, exactly that. With three hitos, you fucking idiot. I'm gonna just jump there, right? Just jump in. Okay, we can't really kill him. Chen is here, unfortunately, so we have to go back. It was a good kill. I have fairly arcane boot very quickly. Good action right there. Okay, I'm gonna finish my arcane boot. Is he okay, this freaking guy? <laughs> He's just always like running somewhere. Alright. Nice gang from Queen of Pain. I would just like to see like if Klinks would be really very effective against uh, that guy on the mid, um, Scarf Mage. Because Scarf Mage is. He's really dominating on the mid. Like, I have to check the competitive yet, but he's really, really dominating, honestly. Okay, I'm gonna go probably go back, because Chen is here, even though I should be defending a little bit probably here. I'm gonna wait probably for my next uh, Ancient Spirit, and then we're gonna go back. Because there's a push coming. Push. They don't know if th that I don't have a mana, so I think it's kind of perfect. Okay. As you can see, I'm very tanky hero, so I can actually stick for a while here. Stick for a while. I'm gonna go back. Try to give him vision a little bit, but obviously Chen is such a good hero. I'm gonna probably upgrade the courier here. 
myself, because I have kind of a money. We did some actions on the top lane, so we can actually upgrade. It was a very successful top lane, I have to say. From this moment, like, he has soul ring and phase boots, which is not such a big deal. Plus, we have our levels after these actions, so, I am mean, at least... <laughs> Again, I have, like, levels, which is strange. Bum bum bum. Oh nope. <laughs> don't 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 write anything to me, please. I'm embarrassed. That I almost tried to steal your money. Let's go back. <laughs> we did what we could, let's go back. This is the hero. You do one action, let's go home. No man or no nothing. So see like level wise, this was very important that I had level seven. Because I inflicted a lot of damage, you know, picked out a lot of damage even from the Ancestor Spirit. That's why I would like to be on the top lane in the first place solo and not with the Clinks. Even though it worked in the end because, you know, Quop went there, which was nice move. Middle nice move from Quop. Uh, to went there to kind of gang with us. Okay, let's see what we can do. I could get uh, something aggressive-wise. Mech. I could start building mech because I'm actually li really getting a lot of money here. Okay. Let's get this creep wave off, and we can deny that shit. The enemy's bottom tower has fallen. Yeah, I don't have a cooldown yet. Seven seconds. They unfortunately do have vision on me, so... Your top tower has been denied. Let's see what we can do here. Yeah, I don't want to just jump there. I'm gonna wait for my ulti, probably. I could get Clinks to scout, like, from behind, and then I could initiate exactly that. If he's gonna go for it. Nope, okay. I will make things right. <laughs> Everything! He's fucking fast, guy. There's a lot of heroes here. Gonna go because there's a spectre. We need to defend the spectre, of course. Of you. Yeah, the no time for this shit. Plus, you know what? My item build is completely finished, so I don't need. As I said, like RK boot is really. See the damage that is absolutely retarded against that hero. That's I think Clinks could be actually the choice against Skyrath Mage. Meaning on the public, of course, in a, you know real games. Depends, of course, uh, what they're gonna do, but still. Scarf Mage can be the hero. Oh, sorry, uh, Klinks could be the hero against Scarf Mage, honestly. I have to kind of try it maybe sometimes. No! You can see the difference in the stats, like... Actually, she has HPs too. That's a Battle Fury. No, don't jump me. Don't jump me. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Alright. Um, let's ch actually check the items. Alright. Pretty cool. There's no tower on top, so we can maybe move to some other lanes. Skyrim actually doesn't have so much movement speed. Freeze, what? 25? Free 75. Okay. You know, we can put some pressure as these type of heroes on the enemy team pretty easily. Don't worry about it, I got it. 
That's one of the uses of the ulti that you can actually do. That's a good trade, nevertheless. Yes, yeah, I, you know, I'm, I think I'm decent with the Elder Titan. The thing is, if I had like level 3, I would be completely pointless. So I definitely like levels with this, you know. I'm gonna pop this and go probably home. Maybe full of farm, little farm in the jungle, could be nice too. Because my mech is very, very soon active. This is what I actually like Skyrath Mage. Sorry, uh, fucking Skyrath Mage is all, always in my head. <laughs> I actually like uh, this hero and the Elder Titan. I'm gonna farm there, okay. I like him on a hard lane. It's kind of strange, but what I saw, there's not many things to get, that can kind of trade with him. Because he can, get, he can gain movement speed from the Ancestor Spirit, he can gain damage from the Ancestor Spirit, so he's very strong, even like, you know, like support, support, hitting him in the face. He can withstand it with some regen and kind of gain the XP that he needs. And it almost worked out every single time that I was actually hardlining with this hero. Always got the arcane boot, which I think for my style, just being in the action, not really farming so much. I oh, can't really do much. He still be okay though. <laughs> well, that's a good thing that he's rushing that item because it definitely helped. I still need some gold, some gold. Yeah, I don't have shit, man. Gotta finish my mech and then I'm gonna, of course, join the team again. Nice. He has glimpse, I should say, yep, there's a glimpse. They're at war, so they can definitely fight under the tower, so I think it's gonna be okay. Oh, she's got Vanguard! What a noob! Where's your battle fury? Where is your battle fury? Buh! <laughs> yeah. Or is the vanguard like uh, wrong on every hero? Yeah, well, every hero, right? Yeah, I think so. Gee, vanguard. That's bad. She should be okay. Yeah, exactly. Okay in the you know next situation. Would it be great if I was there? Would be really good. You know what? It's a fault of Clinks, actually, if you think about it, because he. Okay, this is gonna be kind of hard to understand. If he pushed faster, I could get my level 11. Oh, what happened? Punch him in the face a few times. It's interesting, you definitely force sometimes that may be what you want to do. You, you can kind of force some immunities from people, because he has to go immunity. He doesn't know what's behind me. You know, it can be, it's a five second stun. He has to get that immunity going. Even nakes can actually, you can force immunity from an nakes, and then maybe jump in for something else after it's over. So you can do, do even that. So it's not just limited by somebody has immunity. If you can force the immunity, it's still kind of win, right? This doesn't cost much mana, plus it's rotating. It can rotate back in like 17 seconds. Okay, let's go on the bottom. Let's go bottom. Let's see Spectre's ult if she has 14 seconds, okay. They have like 3 heroes, Chen, Skyrim Mage and uh, Disruptor that bar basically destroyed what, with what I have. Yeah. Okay. She's nothing going for him. He ignores it completely. <laughs> Who cares? Who cares? Yeah, you are alone there, though. You need to kind of figure out yourself. Let's get this shit going. Did we win at least? Yeah, we win. Your middle tower 
He defused him. <laughs> Good thing I wasn't watching that one. Alright. The enemy's bottom tower has fallen. He has fallen. Of course it did. The initiation just is very very strong. I'm always keeping my distance and I go in after the stun, after the ulti. Because then, for them it's hard to initiate on you when there's a, somebody in a stun for example, or your ulti in a place. It's hard for, for them to be like, okay let's focus on that guy then. Ooh. Oh there's a fucking guy. Did we kill him? We didn't. Oh that's <laughs> bad. Freaking stun. I ran the fuck in. It's not bad. <laughs> not the best idea, man. I said my basic stats or base stats are great. That does not include the gain of the stat, which is terrible actually. I definitely nicely cleaned that ulti of his with my bodies, it seemed very nicely. Okay. You know him, he's gonna be spinning, so I'm not gonna even bother. Yeah, bye back. She doesn't have ult yet. Oh, because she used it already. Of course. <laughs> you would think. Okay, let's go top lane. We can definitely push it. Let's go top lane. Yeah. Not much I can do about that. We definitely are winning at this game, I feel. Um, but I think Elder Titan is hero that can be the one winning the game. At least some situation. I mean, I won definitely the bottom situation. Maybe even some situation here, the preparation. I think he's a really strong hero. Yeah. But you definitely need team that is working for you. If I was like kept like completely shut down on, on a top lane with the clinks, and nothing was happening, this wouldn't be such a good game, I would say. Definitely not. Okay. I'm buying, like, free ports already. <laughs> well, as you can see, I kind of want to jump all over the place. And kill people, of course. Well, I don't know how. I would like to know how. Oh, we have stun of... We have uh, invis. Not invis. This fucking thing. But he has invis, apparently. I don't think he checked. I didn't check myself, but I don't think he checked too. Nope. Come on, man. This is such an idiotic strategy of them. <laughs> that was very cheap of them. Very cheap, man. Very cheap. They probably do have vision there. Which is what you would expect, but I'm surprised. Because they are playing so far very terribly. So I'm surprised that... Of course Chen is there, so he can kind of do it, but still. Yeah, as you can see, like, this was much, much more about the vision and luck of theirs. I need to be, like, away from the vision, which usually I would be with somebody else in a teamfight. But this was kind of, like, instant situation of Resta being, you know, in a teamfight, which he shouldn't. But I have to say, Chen is not doing what Chen does in this game. And I play a lot of Chen. A lot of Chen. <laughs> Insane amount of Chen, I think. And... I actually want that shit. Well... Oh, this is kill! Focus! Focus on it! There you go. Yeah, Chen so far wasn't, be, wasn't really so active in this game, I have to say. Nah, nah, nah. The good thing would be to have some sort of initiation, I would say. Right now we don't really have that. Meaning, something that can kind of tank it, and also do something with it. Whoa! Whoa, whoa bro! <laughs> Attack the tower! Not the guy. Not the guy.
Get back. Well, I'm trying that. No fucking way he's gonna do that. Okay. He doesn't have a glimpse level 4. That's for sure. Okay. I'm gonna left level 4 her. <laughs> it seems the Rasta is always there <laughs> eating all the cooldowns for theirs. Which is great. Rush. Mm, not sure. Of course, I'm not gonna be doing a rush, I'm, I'll be standing behind. But you know, I never actually build this hero as a farmer, and I honestly feel it's just not worthy. I think this is better, just being kind of the break of the actions or the initiation itself. I just feel it's better, and I just kind of don't need damage items for it. I think some other heroes could benefit more from these. Good kill. I have no idea they are doing Roshan, by the way. I had no clue. <laughs> I think he said Roshan, like, let's do Roshan. I would say, I, I, I kind of believe that's our perspective, how what to do right now, but apparently they were doing Roshan. Hm, who knew? Should, like, maybe take the aggro away. I don't have shit, man. I have, don't have shit. That's a juggernaut, of course. Yeah, we have to focus on the building. Focus here, on the right! Okay. Let's get the fuck out of here. Nice. For us, of course. <laughs> Not talking from a perspective of a team that's playing against us. Okay, my next item is gonna be right now, it's a questionable, but... I think Ghost Captor would be nice. And on the other hand, Blade Mail will be extremely... effective against one hero of theirs. Against one hero of theirs, I'm not gonna say, I'm gonna say who, for the bright ones, you already know. You already have a clue. So right now the goal is... He releases his ulti. My perspective, or my goal, is to run in and bathe in it, okay? Take a bath. Wash the head, the hair, armpits, everything in it. Okay? In his ulti. That's the goal. Of course, while my blade mail is activated, because if not then that would be waste of me. That would be waste. Of one good hero. Does he have any mobility? He's just the slow. Okay. <laughs> okay. Mm. It's funny because they do have ward there, I believe so. Okay, that was easier than I would think it would. Okay, I'm gonna be back, because clock initiation can be pain in the ass, so I'm gonna be just in the back and controlling the situation. When they initiate, I'm gonna just pop the ult immediately. Nope. No! Come on, bro. Hmm. Okay, well that's the game. Thank you for watching, this was Elder Titan yet again, as you can see. That's kind of the gameplay that you will be seeing from every single Elder Titan of mine. Don't mind Hardlane. Would like to be actually alone most of the times there. 
I was kind of debating, like, in the beginning, of course, not playing this hero uh, and playing him for the first times so in Dota 2. Kind of debating if hard lane would be good because you don't have really have much of escaping ability, but the armor is okay, base stats are amazing, plus you have something even to last it a few creeps in a, from the big distance. I always, never, you know, in five games, let's say, in a row, I actually got my item, which is Arcane Boot, and then I was being effective on, you know, for the team, so it always went like this. Okay, well, I can do surplus and damage there. No! Fuck my life! That didn't so much damage as I would think it would. <laughs> okay, well, that failed. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, so pull pretty classic Elder Titan from me. I don't think I'm gonna be getting to the point that I'll be farming him. There's always some better hero to farm, in my opinion. This is kind of a, for me, preparation of action or breaking of the actions all the time. And as you can see, my statistics are not bad at all for this, like, shorter game. But that's all, that's all for this one. Alright.